the storm's coming. <laughs> Hey, what's that crap on your face? Is it wash off? Captain Boomerang, Suicide Squad, Digger Harkness, um, Aussie, Larrikin. Uh, can't wait to do it again. Kyle Reese. I mean, Terminator, Genesis. That was huge. I don't know. Working with Arnie and Amelia Clark. Uh, had an amazing time. Don't think I'll get to do it again. Varo. Yeah, Varo got killed um, at the end of season one. Funnily enough, one of the roles that I think I get recognized most for uh, still, you know, which is kind of crazy because that thing had such reach. That was my introduction to this world of on-screen performance, really, uh, and a very uh, special project close to my heart. Garth, good old Garth. That was a lot of fun. Um, that was totally out of left field, but getting to, uh, to play opposite Amy Poehler and, you know, that whole gang, I just, that was like a total riot. I had, I didn't know anything about that heading in. I didn't, I wasn't raised on the original film, so I had all this kind of no context. And I remember like watching the series that they'd done, which was a prequel or a sequel or something, and kind of being like, this is totally bonkers. But that was a, a, a real joy to get to play. Yeah, Eric, couple holes in the head there. Don't miss having to scrub the transfer tattoos off my freshly shaven neck every day. Yeah, let's leave that one in the past. Hideaway Tom, reclusive, fractured individual, but a loving father and, and a really special role for me to play. A, uh, a real change of pace, getting to, to, to father a child on screen and have such an intimate relationship with my son, played by Finn Little in uh, Storm Boy, of course. Yeah, yeah, total privilege. He's a good boy. You're a lucky man. April 5th, select theatres. Check it out, the storm's coming. <laughs> that was great.